The mayor of flood-ravaged Wairoa has made a plea to the Prime Minister. We've had enough and we need your help. Christopher Luxon visited the region today and he's vowed to all four mayors that he'll speed up progress and turbocharge the recovery. Here's political reporter Lloyd Burr. A van of politicians arriving in Wairoa, a place that wants pledges and promises. We need to get funding to get it looking like it used to. There's a lot of emotion in Wairoa, but patience, they've run out. We need things to start moving quicker. We've just had enough, we're very vulnerable, and we've just got heaps of sort of like anxiety now, we just don't feel like we're getting anywhere. Mayor Craig Little and his deputy Denise Eaglesome Karikari sat down with the Prime Minister, the Transport Minister, the Emergency Management Minister and local MPs to make their case. Between all of them, they now know, they've heard us, and we'll keep, they'll keep hearing us, believe me. And this is what they're asking for. We need houses, we need to get our people back into their homes. You know, we've got no river protection, God's sake, one of the only places we've been in New Zealand that hasn't. And we need a state highway too that is resilient and is not going to cut us off from the rest of um, Hawke's Bay. So, will Luxon deliver them? Well, we, we, we want to make, we want to get an assessment of what it is that they actually need it. And some of it will be money and some of it will be regulation. And some of it will be, frankly, um, you know, actually how do we fast track consenting so that we don't get locked in a loop of endless conversation and talk and actually things not getting done. Regarding the resilience of State Highway 2. There's a big conversation to happen on State Highway 2. And a big goodbye to the Napier to Wairoa rail line. The railway uh, is a low priority and is, and, and is something that we shouldn't be progressing. I'd sooner take the money from that and go invest it in upgrading the roads uh, and, and making investments in flood protection. Luxon also visited Napier and met with the mayors of Central Hawke's Bay, Napier and Hastings District Councils and Mana Whenua. I have to say Hawke's Bay is the best in the country in terms of the collaboration that happens between um, the district councils, the regional council and also Mana Whenua. No announcements on Luxon's first visit to the region as Prime Minister, but plenty of personal assurances of progress, sealed with plenty of hugs. Lloyd Berg, New South.